here this morning. I think it's your embarculator or something. Oh, hey. All right, yeah. Hey, look, I wanted to say I'm sorry about that whole stew thing. Oh, don't even worry about it, man. I, I'm feeling pretty Steve today. Really? Yeah, dude, I had the best date of my life last night. Dude, I, I think I'm in love. Dude, I hope you didn't tell her that. No, no. Oh, dude, there's a certain order you're supposed to do things in, and time someone you love them is definitely last in that order. Well, when are you supposed to tell them? I don't know, maybe your 40th wedding anniversary <laughs> or something? I don't see a problem. I'm going to tell you this one last time, and maybe you should tattoo it on your dick so that you don't forget, okay? We pursue that which retreats from us. I just don't get the whole retreating thing, you know? Look, chicks are like hunters, man. They want a bag, a lion, or a bear, something really hard to catch. And along comes Dave, you know? And you're like this affectionate little puppy. You're cute, but you're way too easy to catch, and that bores them. And with chicks, boredom equals death, man. You can't bore them. So now I'm boring. No, no. Dogs, okay? They don't chase a rock that's just sitting on the ground. Maybe some dogs do. No, they, they like chasing rabbits that dart in and out of bushes, you know what I mean? Oh, so now I'm supposed to be like a bunny? No, no, you're supposed to be the thing that retreats, okay? And that takes us to part three of the Tao of Steve, okay? All right, after you've eliminated your desire, and after you've been excellent in her presence, then you must retreat, okay? No, it's just too complicated. Look, man, it, for great-looking guys, they got no problem. They can just slide by on their appearance. But for guys like us, man, okay? Like, successful hooking up with the ladies requires a little work and a lot of intelligence. All right? Thanks for this thing, man. It's gonna come in handy.